excellence online subscribe to our channel now for more educational videos and press the bell icon for more updates bismillah rahman rahim this is adnan nimat from excellence online platform uh, right now i'm uh, i'm going to teach you about uh, narration direct speech and indirect speech uh, in grammar section we have different topics uh, one of them is uh, narrations uh, speeches direct and indirect speech 9th and 10th class first or second classes graduation classes for report writing uh, for uh, <coughs> dialogue writing we need a uh, narration uh, writing skills direct speech and indirect speech ah ji ab one is uh, interrogative sentences we have different rules of uh, this grammar uh, one of them is a uh, uh, interrogative sentence if we have been given uh, this type of sentence how to change uh, from direct speech into indirect speech Uh, ji, we have one sentence. He said to them, "Do you play tennis?" A uh, question mark. We have two types of uh, interrogative sentence. One is uh, confirmative. Second, we have informative. A uh, confirmative, uh, the answer will be yes and no. And when we confirmative, we talk about the answer. Which one comes? Yes and no. The answer comes. Start comes. What are helping verbs? What are auxiliary verbs? What are they? Do, does, will, may, might, can, could, would. इससे स्टार्ट कराते हैं इसका आंसर यस या नो में आएगा नंबर सेकंड टाइप ऑफ इंट्रोगेटिव क्वेश्चंस वी हैव इंफॉर्मेटिव क्वेश्चन 9 डब्ल्यू एच व्हाट वेयर हुज होम व्हाई देयर 9 डब्ल्यू एच पर्स इसमें से जो भी क्वेश्चंस का आंसर आंसर यस या नो में नहीं आता आपको उसको रिप्लाई करना होगा इंफॉर्मेशन देनी होगी वहां पर सो वी आर डिस्कसिंग कंफर्मेटिव क्वेश्चन ही सेड टू देम डू यू प्ले टेनिस Uh, say to will be changed into as interrogated uh, question inquired of uh, to be simple uh, uh, to clarify simply taki sabko samajh aa jaye hum itne words ko use nahi karte hain hum as use karte hain he asked them uh, ji, for joining we have one conjunction <coughs> we do not use uh, that uh, in place of that yahan pe two conjunction use kar sakte hain one is if a second is whether a in mein se ek use karenge he asked them if Uh, we have uh, one ten second uh, sentence. Ten is our present indefinite, present simple, and your uh, sentence is our interrogative. From interrogative, we will convert into affirmative sentence. From present tense, it will be converted into past tense. He asks them if uh, they. यहाँ पे जो subject लिखा you लिखा हुआ है. You जो है second person के लायक आपने object से change करना है, them से change करना है. और them जब हम यहाँ पे use करेंगे subject के case में यहाँ पे they आ जाएगा. Uh, if they uh, present tense, we will convert into past tense. If they play tennis, ah, ji, हमने यहाँ पे tense को भी change करना था और sentence को भी change करना है. यहाँ पे हम ये नहीं बोल सकते did they play? Interrogative होएगा, affirmative use करेंगे. Ah, uh, he asked them if they uh, play tennis. It will be right. Number second example, she said to him, Have you completed the assignment? कुछ mark लिखा है. Ah, it uh, start from uh, have you. Again, we have a uh, confirmation. अ सेंटेंस विल बी चेंज और टेंस विल बी चेंज दोनों चीज हम चेंज करेंगे इसके अंदर शी सेड टू हिम शी आस्क हिम फॉर जॉइनिंग के लिए हम यहां पे इफ यूज करते हैं इफ हमने यहां पे यूज कर लिया आ जी हैव यू कंप्लीटेड योर असाइनमेंट्स अ प्रेजेंट परफेक्ट टेंस है पास्ट परफेक्ट में जाएगा स्टार्ट जो है यहां पे हमने यू से करना है यहां पे जो यू जो है सब्जेक्ट है तो हम चेंज करेंगे इसको ऑब्जेक्ट में वहां पे हिम लिखा हुआ है हिम जो है का ऑब्जेक्टिव केस है सब्जेक्टिव में आएगा तो ही आ जाएगा Uh, she asked him if he had played. If he had played. Uh, uh, number next, we have. Uh, have you completed your assignments? I'm going to change it again. She asked him if he had completed his assignments. Again, four points. Uh, say to uh, will be changed to ask. For joining uh, uh, two speeches, two classes, I'm going to if you skip now or better you skip again. Next is that uh, tense could be changed. Can I say tense could be changed? Can I? A uh, tense is present perfect. It will be converted into past perfect. Sentence we have interrogative. It will be converted into affirmative sentence. Number second we have got interrogative sentence part one. Uh, she said, "I uh, uh, will participate in a contest." Ah, ji. I will participate. It is start from will. Again, confirmative sentence. Uh, she said. Uh, first idea we have. Uh, how can we change? It? She said we do not have object. And what we can write here? Object write here. You mentioned what? Ah, uh, ji. When we do not have object, and then we have you, and we have suppositions. Ah, uh, she said. Uh, she asked him. Here we have him. Suppose what? As an object. Suppose what? 
for joining we have if um, if you skip here a uh, will participate in contest a uh, will come to you come change karenge kis mein object mein karenge wahan pe him likha tha to yahan pe hi aa jayega uh, he would participate in a contest ya apne change karna hoga i said to him did you read books i said to him i asked uh, him for joining we have if yahan pe humne if you skip diya aur we can use a uh, whether uh, did you read book past indefinite past perfect mein aayega ye आ जी इंट्रोगेटिव में अफर्मेटिव में जाएंगे यहां पर आ डिड यू रीड बुक्स हमने इसको ही में चेंज किया यू को ऑब्जेक्ट से चेंज करेंगे वहां पे हिम लिखा था यू जो है सेकंड पर्सन है और ऑब्जेक्टिव केस में हिम था यहां पे सब्जेक्टिव केस में ही आ जाएगा आ इफ ही अ पास इन डेफिनेटली पास परफेक्ट में आएगा इफ ही हैड अ रीड बुक्स दिस इज बेसिक आईडिया इंट्रोगेटिव सेंटेंसेस देयर आर टू टाइप्स ऑफ इंट्रोगेटिव वन इज कंफर्मेटिव सेकंड वी हैव इंफॉर्मेटिव सेंटेंस number next for practice these all are the practice sentences seven sentences for interrogative how to change uh, uh, we have four basic points one is say to uh, will be changed into ask inquired of a uh, question interrogated number next is uh, for joining uh, two classes for joining two report uh, speeches uh, two sentences we have if or whether number third is uh, interrogative sentences will be converted into Uh, upper middle sentences tense will be changed according to rules uh, ye practice one is ki aap iski practice kare aur iska sir answer kaha milega iske answer jo hai next slide mein aapko diye hain clear this is your practice area uh, ji uh, this is assignment number second we are discussing interrogative sentences for interrogative we have wh question informative questions uh, informative we have nine wh what where whose whom and when let's see we have one sentence he said to her what do you want to be Uh, say to as we have discussed will be changed into ask inquired of interrogative and other words uh, to be simplified or to clarify easily we say only one word uh, uh, said to will be changed into uh, ask what do you want to be uh, we have two classes for joining we need one conjunctions uh, we do not use here a uh, whether or if for interrogative sentence again we have two types if we have confirmative question for joining of our two classes we have if but when we have wh question so wh in some cases we use as a conjunction yahan pe what likha hua hai where likha hua hai how likha hoga ye same rahenge conjunction ka function denge linking words ka function denge uh, he said to her or uh, i think you will change this idea this one is a uh, practice what do you want to be uh, he said to her he answer for joining claim that we use nahi karenge if or whether we use nahi karenge what will be remain same then we have do you want to be aji uh, subject is you you will be changed according to the object wahan pe object likha hua hai har likha hua hai objective case mein subjective case mein kya aa jayega she aa jayega what she wanted to be a uh, present tense will be converted into past tense this is basic kind of regarding a uh, practice wh question <coughs> one side we have confirmative second we have informative there's only one difference between two uh, types of interrogative sentences is uh, for conjunction Uh, we do not use uh, if or whether if we have wh questions at man we have only wh words this is the assignments you will do by yourself and we have answer of these uh, questions hopefully you can do uh, i discuss only four points you will follow four points and you will do this practice first we have practice slides next we have answer slides and uh, next we have optative sentences there are seven types of sentences according to sense there are three types of sentences according to structures for the structure simple compound and complex sentences uh, for sense point of view we have interrogative negative affirmative optative imperative or emphatic sentences one of them is optative sentences uh, these sentences usually start from me when we have wish or pray the bikis ko dua dete hain aur unko wishes se uh unke liye hum denge wahan pe hum ye sentences use karte hain uh, mostly it start uh, mostly these sentences start from a uh, mess start hote hain uh, sense is often wish or pray optative sentences humne convert karne hain affirmative sentences mein right ab uh, we have one example uh, he said uh, to them may you live long uh, he said to them may you live long when we have may or at the end of the sentence we do not have question mark interrogative mark then it is optative sentence it is start from the may at the end we have a uh, full stop at one may a uh, wish or pray uh said to will be converted into a uh, wish operate for uh he said to them he wish for them 
मे यू लिव लॉन्ग अगेन सब्जेक्ट पहले हम इसको पहले यूज करेंगे सब्जेक्ट को यहाँ पे जो लिखा हुआ है ऑब्जेक्ट से चेंज कर लेंगे और वहां पे ध्यान लिखा था ऑब्जेक्टिव के सेट में सब्जेक्टिव में लेके आएंगे यहाँ पे दे आ जाएगा ही विश फॉर देम दैट दे माइट लिव लॉन्ग मे को अपने माइंड में कन्वर्ट करना है बेसिक आइडिया इज ही यू कैन डू ओनली थ्री पॉइंट कीप इन माइंड वन इज से टू विल बी कन्वर्टेड इन टू प्रेड और विश वन सेकेंड वी हैव डाइट फॉर ज्वाइनिंग टू क्लासेस दैट यूज किया मे को अपने कन्वर्ट करना माइंड में सब्जेक्ट को हमने पहले यूज करना होगा ऑप्टेटिव सेंटर से हमने अपरमेटिव सेंटर्स बनाना होगा नंबर सेकेंड he uh, he said to her, May you get, uh, success here and hereafter. He said to her, he, uh, wish for her. She might get success there and thereafter. पे लिखा हुआ है लिखा हुआ है बाई मिस्टेक लिखा हुआ है और यहाँ पे आपने उसको चेंज करना है विश में चेंज करना है और या प्रेड फॉर्म में चेंज करना है हेयर एंड हेयर आफ्टर आपने देयर यूज करना है और देयर आफ्टर यूज करना होगा यहाँ पे नहीं आएगा यहाँ पे क्या यूज करेंगे ही प्रेड फॉर हर ही विश फॉर हर और बाकी ज्वाइनिंग के लिए हम दैट यूज करते हैं मे को अपने माइंड में कन्वर्ट करना है और जो रूल्स होंगे हम डिस्कस करेंगे यू को अपने चेंज करना है ऑब्जेक्ट में चेंज करना है वहां पे हर लिखा था ऑब्जेक्टिव केसेस था यहाँ पे क्या आ जाएगा शी यूज करेंगे ये आप सिंपली यूज कर सकते हैं जी ऑप्टेटिव सेंटेंसेस भी है प्रैक्टिस फोर सेंटेंसेस प्रैक्टिस ऑफ फोर सेंटेंसेस अकॉर्डिंग टू द प्रीवियस रूल एज वी एम डिस्कस जिसके बेसिक रूल्स हैं वो आप उसको जहन में रखेंगे यू विल कीप इन योर माइंड एंड यू विल कन्वर्ट प्रैक्टिस Uh, this is answer of uh, practice uh, solve papers. Uh, next we have exclamatory sentences. As we have discussed, there are different types of sentences. One of them is uh, exclamatory sentence. Sign of exclamation we have. Uh, three basic uh, types of feelings: sudden feelings, or uh, a pleasure feeling, or sad feelings. We have interjection, expression, right? For expression, uh, he said to her, "Last my brother died." The word is "last," or "ra." or uh, this old expression right now people they have different expressions and all person have different expression this all expression cannot be written uh, so that's why linguist or grammarian they use uh, fix uh, past expressions wo yahan pe use kar sakte hain uh, he said to her first point is said to will be changed into exclaim with or this a sense hai ki hum isme convert karna hoga yahan pe jo sense aa raha hai wo aa raha hai this pleasures ka ग्रीक का सारो का ऐसे जो भी वर्ड्स यूज कर सकते हैं ही विद जी अनाउंस शो करते हैं पे सैड फीलिंग शो करता है ग्रीफ शो करता है तो हमने यहाँ पे वर्ड यूज किया सारो यूज किया ज्वाइन करने के लिए हम दैट यूज करेंगे अनाउंस खत्म कर देंगे जी माई ब्रदर डाइड पास इन डेफिनेट पास परफेक्ट में जाएगा माई इज फर्स्ट पर्सन है सब्जेक्ट से हम चेंज करेंगे सब्जेक्ट इज ही लिखा हुआ है तो यहाँ पे हिज आ जाएगा हिज ब्रदर हैड डाइट यूज कर a uh, second sentence is she said to him hurra i have defeated my enemies i have defeated my enemies uh, hurra is expression excitement when people are very excited they use this kind of expression whether in sports in education in chobis in other fields uh, she said to him she is playing with a uh, intense uh, excitement uh, pleasures happiness delight then we have that mujhe hurra likha tha khatam kar denge i have defeated my enemies I is first person, my is first person. Uh, both will be converted according to the subject. Ma, but she mentioned the other. Uh, I am defeated my enemies. She had defeated her enemies. Uh, present perfect tense. Come the past me. Let it change. I come the change. Cut the subject me. She had defeated her. One sentence as we discuss. I uh, defeated my enemies. Apne change karna. She had defeated her enemies. प्रेजेंट परफेक्ट टेंस आपने कन्वर्ट करना है पास परफेक्ट में यूज करना है आई लिख कमाए माई लिख कमाए फर्स्ट पर्सन के लाते हैं सब्जेक्ट से हम चेंज करते हैं अजी तो आई को आपने चेंज करना है शी में और माई को चेंज करना है आपने हर में यूज करना है नंबर नेक्स ही सेड वाओ इट इज एन एक्साइटिंग गेम अजी वाओ इज एक्सप्रेशन वेन पीपल दे हैव इंटेंस एक्साइटमेंट वंडर फीलिंग्स समथिंग इज अनबिलीवेबल मैसिंग डिफिकल्ट टू बिलीव so we use these kind of expressions <coughs> is claim with wonder when we have this expression uh, this introduction wow uh, we convert into wonder surprise astonishment as a word from isko use karte hain <coughs> again for joining that is karenge it is an exciting game aaj uh, is baat mein convert karte hain it was an exciting game uh, yes we are discussing the exclamatory sentences uske three basic feelings hoti hain jo humne discuss karni hai sad feelings honge isme अनाउंस लिखा होगा इंटरजेक्शन 
सेकेंड वी हैव हैप्पी फीलिंग्स एक्साइटिंग फीलिंग्स हुड्रा मैंशन क्या आएगा और रिलेटेड सिमिलर एक्सप्रेशन लॉसिस वंडर फीलिंग्स आएंगी समथिंग इज अनबिलीवेबल एस्टॉनिशमेंट जहाँ पे होती है वहाँ पे हम वाव यूज करते हैं जब हमने चेंज कर दिए अगेन आई एम आई एम टेलिंग यू स्टेट टू को आपने चेंज करना है एक्सक्लेम विथ देन अकॉर्डिंग टू द सेंस ऑफ द सेंटेंस आपने वहाँ पे वर्ड यूज करना है इफ इट इज अप्पी सेंटेंस आप लेट डिलइट हैप्पीनेस जॉय ये यूज कर सकते हैं इफ इट शोज ग्रीव तो आपने यूज करना होगा एक्सक्लेम विथ के बाद ग्रीव शो करें सैडनेस है डिस्प्लेचर है सारो है यूज कर सकते हैं लॉस इज वी हैव Amazing feeling, something is unbelievable, surprising feelings. We have different expression as we are discussing. Exclamatory sentence practice one. Uh, these four sentences are given to you. Uh, try to understand uh, and solve the practice. Do not convert uh, forward the slide until unless you complete this. You will complete it. And after that, you will see that your answer is correct. After that, you will go to the next slide. Ah, uh, yes. These all are the answers. Uh, hopefully, you like this video. The basic idea regarding uh, narrations. Uh, we discuss only three types of sentences. One is interrogative sentence. Second, we have optative sentences. Last, we have exclamatory sentences. Inshallah, we will continue further. Thank you.